Oh, hello everyone and welcome back to Life of Wonders, welcome back to my channel, my name is Polo and I love making doll toys and Disney videos, so if you like this kind of content, definitely stay tuned to my channel. Uh, today we're going to be unboxing and reviewing in detail this beautiful Charlotte uh, that is the bestie, the best friend of Diana from Princess and the Frog and I'm super excited because I've wanted uh, to add Charlotte to my collection for such a very long time this is the second release that was um that happened just a few years ago um the first release obviously when the movie came out and uh, the differences are i think that this one has better articulation the face coat is the same and the dresses differ um the original dress like the first release dress was bigger in a way uh but this one is just so cool from as far as i can see as well and i'm i'm loving this character i mean first of all is tiana's best friend it's like a hilarious um character that adds a lot of humor to the whole plot and i couldn't have i couldn't wait to have this princess as part of my collection it's just so bubblegum uh pink uh of a personality as well so anyway this is the box it comes in um here we can read its name charlotte uh disney princess um and then on the side we actually can see her like right over there and here we see tiana and um she appears i mean dressed like this as um uh, when tiana first um meets up with um prince naveen in a in a frog form <laughs> and here on the other side we have tiana enjoying cooking and then on the back we have this very beautiful um rather interesting uh artwork of her uh she looks so much more like mean in this part um but anyway i think that she's been portrayed really well with that sculpt really like it's truly amazing and then here we have tiana as well so you can see um, the hairdo is very very similar. She has that tiara. The only thing that probably is missing is the fan But I do have extra fans from uh, Mulan that would fit her and the globes um, Other than that the color um, It's very very typical um, Or very very close to to the one she wears in the movie the price at the time was about 14 Great Britain pounds Um yeah, I think it's the same price uh, for a classic doll right now. That would translate into 17, 18 euros, I would say. Or slightly cheaper, I don't know, because this was before the inflation. So um, now I will free her completely from the package and I will give you all sorts of details. Well, and here we have beautiful Charlotte out of the box. And I have to say, I love her. I really do. I know that the first edition came with the puffier uh, gown, but this one does not disappoint. It has this beautiful satin that has a really nice movement to it. Um, it doesn't have a petticoat underneath, but rather um, like actually soft paper to keep it like completely full and then these two pieces were pinned but I took it away and there's like this central ribbon and these two pieces to the side um, that is a bit of a um, it makes me think of Cinderella and also Ariel in a way because um, both her their dresses have uh, these elements um, one way or another and here we have this beautiful face it's incredibly nicely sculpted and painted uh to resemble charlotte from the animation i love the bun um and how the hair has been styled like part parted in one of the sides um this sort of like bun reminds me of the cinderella but also like the disney style cinderella that has like a wider uh, ban. Obviously her um, 
face or head is like quite round and big uh, which is very cartoonish but it's how she's portrayed in the animation and the whole outfit is just one piece but again it's really nicely executed for just being a classic doll as such the articulation is on the L, um, shoulder elbow wrist uh, and it's very nice because it's a gradual articulation so you can hold the poses really nicely. I love the poofy uh, sleeves with glitter uh, to go with these two pieces uh, over here. And then she has a satin color that it's pretty sturdy. So it looks so well on her. And I love her tiara because it's just like the one she wears in the movie. And another thing I was very uh, surprised about is those earrings that can actually be taken off and um, here in the picture, uh, we can see they're like sparkling bits. Oh, one thing she's missing, um, it's uh, her beauty uh, mark right there. Um, she doesn't have it here, um, but that's okay. She has beautiful uh, big blue eyes that seem to be like so crazy, like her personality in a way. And... Um, and the earrings are the uh, plastic gray or silver, uh, but not chromatic, same as for the tiara. And then for her hair, um, she has a more of a nashi blonde than normally Cinderella does, um, in my opinion. Then she has peachy uh, lips and a little bit of blush. She's just so, so pretty. And then the um the rest of articulation, she has bent and snapped knees. And the thing I don't particularly support are the flat feet. Um, she has these slippers that are flat. But I think right now, I mean, I, I made a bit of an exercise to keep them down. But most of the time when they're in box, um, the feet are like looking up I and mean, then it's kind of very hard to put them you know but you just need to spend some time doing that at, and it's rubbery and it will at the end so these are the I think that the first edition came with heels and this one is obviously coming with flats uh, but other than that she's just so so pretty so beautiful I'm going to show you the back the whole dress or gown um is one piece that velcros in the back including the color uh up until here and it's just like one layer but again like the results um are pretty amazing and i think she looks so gorgeous and yeah so now diana has her bestie uh with her and i'm super happy and i'm super happy to to be sharing it with all of you as well um, so I hope this has been of help and uh, you've enjoyed it and if you have don't forget to give me a thumbs up uh, let me know about your thoughts and feelings um, I will always uh, get back to you and um, I'm very interested to know um, about your opinions really on these super gorgeous um, dolls um, for now, I very much hope um, you stay safe and I'll see you all very soon. Bye bye.